What's good, YouTube? My name is Christina, aka I'm Miss Chrissy Doe, um, founder of She Slays Goals, advocate of all things health. And I want to pop on today and tell you uh, five things you can do to lose five pounds in five days. So I have been able to lose over 46 pounds over the last year. And I want to share with you some of the things that I've been able to do. Some of these things are real super basic things. Some of these things are more complex things. But at any rate, it's going to help you be able to lose weight. It's going to help you be able to possibly generate some extra revenue. And uh, more importantly, it's going to help you feel better. Right. So the first thing you need to do if you're trying to lose five pounds in five days is to walk. Do some type of exercise or strenuous activity for 30 minutes a day minimum. Now, for me, I try to do 60 minutes because, you know, starting off, I did 30 minutes. The weight kind of fell off. But as I progressed in that thing, your body kind of gets used to working out. And then, you know, you kind of have to switch up your regimen a little bit. So what I did was I started off doing 30 minutes and then I would work my way up. So I'll walk for 45 minutes and I'll do strength training for like 20 minutes to 30 minutes so that I'm getting, you know, the muscle in. I'm building up muscle in areas I want to build muscle up in. And, and, you know, when you do strength training, it burns calories longer. So if you lift weights, you're going to burn calories longer. Even if it seems like your weight is going up a little bit, don't worry about it because you're going to be getting toned in the areas where you want to get toned in. So the first thing you want to do if you're trying to lose five pounds in five days is to make sure that you are working out for at least 30 to 60 minutes every single day. The second thing you want to do is is make sure that you eat in clean. Now, of course, you're going to have situations where you might have a cookie here or you might have a piece of cake there or somebody's birthday come up. But eating clean is imperative to being able to lose weight. And like I was saying before, some of these things are things that you already know to do. Some of these things are going to be like not so conventional, right? But I'm just going to share with you what I've been doing, um, especially for this last 25 pounds that I've been able to get off in order to lose weight. So the first one is is to make sure that you get some type of exercise 30 to 60 minutes a day. The second one is to make sure that you, you know what I'm saying, eat clean. So don't worry about it. If you need help, I will put a link below um, to share with you a meal plan that I think is excellent. It's like a keto-based meal plan, right? And so it's going to help you get all your vitamins and nutrients and stuff like that. And you, it's a 1,500 calorie diet that you can click below to have access to now it's only a 10 day plan but the goal and the whole premise of it is for you to kind of get the gist of what to eat what to do how to maneuver so that you know you can set a tone for yourself you can switch it up sometimes if you get tired of salad you can eat a soup sometimes if you get tired of a soup or a salad you can eat you know a sandwich i kind of had this theory is soup salad um subway smoothie and, and stir fry okay so soup salad subway smoothie and stir fry so it's like a 5s thing and it's like i haven't seen it anywhere but when i eat i try to mix it up right subway we know people eat subway and lose weight so you know soup salad subway stir fry and smoothie so when I do that, it seems like, you know, I'm eating cleaner or I'm drinking cleaner or whatever. And that kind of helps me. It's not anything that I've really seen. It's just something that I kind of go by. Like if I'm working, I come home, whip up a stir fry with like, and it doesn't have to be a fancy stir fry. You could just take a literally like a bag of frozen um, broccoli and cauliflower and carrots, sprinkle a little soy sauce on it with some brown rice, saute you up some mushrooms. If you're not eating meat, if you are eating meat, saute you up some chicken or some shrimp. Throw it on top, a little soy sauce, a little yum yum sauce. Keep it moving, right? If you out and about and you tired of eating salads every day, just go to Subway, get a six cent sub, get a veggie sub or a sub with a little bit of meat on it. You know what I'm saying? Not the whole 12 inch, just a six inch. And, and after a while, your stomach will shrink and you will have the ability to really be able to do what you need to do. Next thing I want to talk to you about is detoxing, right? Um, we sit around with uh, intestines like 24 feet long in our stomach. Stuff gets stuck in there, guys. You don't want to be walking around with Thanksgiving dinner in February of 2020 because you haven't really been going to the bathroom. So one thing that I do, and I'll leave a link for you guys, is I drink ISOT. Now, we have 
one two three four different versions this is the the version that you cook you actually brew this and you let it sit in the water for like eight hours and you pour it into a gallon i, I get a gallon of water pour two cups out boil it throw the bag in there leave it for eight hours and then pour whatever's in my pot back into my gallon right so whenever i make my tea i go to the store and i buy a gallon of water first and i'll do a separate video to show you that but you don't even have to do that tlc is so raw that they now have instant teas that you can literally put a pack of tea in here like crystal light i don't have any teas around me i ran out and i'm actually about to go make this one but this is actually my favorite one i lost seven pounds taking this tea but we have instant tea now you just pour it in here you shake it and you drink it wherever you at so we got two different ones that have cbd in it an original instant tea and then we have this tea so i this is like my favorite tea um because i lost seven pounds you know uh in a week with it but my new favorite tea is about to be this raspberry lemonade that's on the way so we're currently sold out of it in the back office if you're a distributor but i think it's rolling out like next week i've been waiting on my package my package ain't here so i'm just gonna make some of this a little bit later today but yeah man detox detoxing is important so first exercise for 30 minutes a day second watch what you eat try to eat right the third thing is to detox i mean they put all kind of stuff in the food pesticides all type of stuff right in the food so you know detox and make sure that your body i mean this this tea right here it helps to suppress your appetite it helps to kill parasites i mean we don't claim to cure or mitigate any disease but it's just the ingredients that are in this tea this tea has persimmon leaves holy thistle malva leaves marshmallow blessed thistle that's how you know it's holy blessed thistle okay uh papaya myrrh they gave myrrh to jesus i'm just saying um chamomile and ginger so everybody knows that ginger helps to burn fat um papaya helps to burn fat the, the thing about the original tea is that it has like its own sweet taste you don't have to add nothing to it some people like to add berries and lemons and all like this and that but really this tea tastes good in and of itself you really don't have to add much right so first again um exercise 30 minutes a day second thing eat right okay third thing to detox find you a detox tea don't worry guys i will leave a link below of all the different types of tea that we have you can choose the one that's best for you now i will say this if you're busy and you don't have time to be brewing stuff and you don't have time to be going to get a gallon and boiling two cups of water and letting it sit in there while you sleep i get it sis get the instant tea shake it up you're gonna get your instant results okay so either way what i find is this one it makes me pee more than the other one it's, it has like a more of a diuretic effect to it but that's just my personal you know what i'm saying observation the fourth thing is to take your vitamins daily right take your daily vitamins if you're going to detox you're going to have to put something else back in right if you're going to put something out you if you letting stuff out you got to be able to put your nutrients back in you know dr sebi his whole family was on the breakfast club and they were talking about the importance of being able to get your nutrients every single day well i take my, a liquid multivitamin called nutriburst right and so this is i mean okay so if you're on youtube you already know if you google biotin a lot of people are saying oh i use the liquid biotin and my hair grows faster the same is true for vitamins when you take a liquid vitamin it hits you on a cellular level it's going to hit you quicker than taking a traditional vitamin right so this when you take this within 15 minutes you're gonna feel it right you're getting your 19 amino acids you're getting your 72 minerals right and again minerals get your minerals every single day you know um this has whole foods in it it, it has a gentle detoxing effect to it but for the most part it's going to put back in everything that you let out while you're detoxing it's going to give you energy to be a better mom to be a better wife to be able to work out if you get off of work and you're tired and you don't feel like working out take a cap full of nutriburst and be on your way you wake up in the morning you feel like you need a cup of coffee you drink nutriburst one of my business partners started drinking nutriburst she don't even drink coffee no more right walking around tired and sluggish when you drink this it's going to be equivalent of eating 10 salads so i don't know about you i don't eat 10 salads a day right and it's safe enough to give to your kids i have a three-year-old and he doesn't really like vegetables i give him a cap full of nutriburst and you know i'll bring him on here one day he's always like i want nutriburst and i ask him why you want nutriburst he's like because it makes me happy you know so i'll bring him on here one day so you can hear from him because you know the kids tell the truth but yeah get your nutrients right put your nutrients back in if you're detoxing you're gonna let it out get your nutrients back in so that your body has the fuel and the energy that it needs in order for you to lose weight right and the third thing i want to tell you is to drink water okay drink water especially if you're detoxing drink water 
they want us to drink like half of our body weight in volume of ounces per day of water i try to shoot for three liters of water a day or a gallon of water whichever one that i'm able to do you know what i'm saying sometimes i know it could get a little bit hard to drink water i'll leave a link below for a gallon thing that you can get from amazon um but yeah drink water so those are the things that i did to lose an extra 25 pounds within two months um as i took these products i continued to lose weight right and i exercised i ate right but even when i don't exercise sometimes i might mess up and i know okay go make you a gallon of tea sip on your tea twice a day and i know off off the rip seven pounds is coming off that week just because i made this tea right and you don't just have to get this tea you can get the cbd tea you can get the original non-cbd tea like this this instant and you can get the raspberry lemonade so we have a regular lemonade raspberry lemonade um and we have a regular ISO instant tea. Now, so what five things do you need to do to lose weight? Exercise, eat right, detox, take your vitamins, okay? Take your vitamins, preferably Nutriburst. It's nothing like else like this on the planet. And fifth, drink your water. If you do those things every day, you should be able to lose the weight that you're trying to lose. Again, I have lost a total of 46 pounds, you know. And so, you know, I know a little something about losing weight. I'll post a before and after picture and put it in so you can see it. But my point is, guys, it's time. You know, I don't know if you made a New Year's resolution, but it's time to get healthy for our families, to get healthy so we can live our best lives. So, you know, I'll leave a link below for all the information that you need in order to get your life. And I'm going to do a second video about a different situation but for the most part thank you guys for your time if you have any questions please feel free to leave me a message um and if you are interested in start and bossing up for 2020 to secure the bag for 2020 i'll leave a link below so that you can boss up as well so whether you want to boss up or you just want to lose your weight however you want to slice it she slays goals is here for you and i'll see you guys in the next video all right